Model, BMW X5 X-Drive 4DEM Sport, Price, £56,705, Engine, 2.0 liter 4 sil petrol plus electric motor, Power slash Torque, 309 bhp slash 450 newton meters, Transmission, 8 speed auto, 4 wheel drive, 0 to 62 miles per hour slash top speed, 6.8s slash 130 miles per hour. In some respects, the X5 X Drive 40E offers the best of both worlds, but in others it's fundamentally flawed. For most, the cheaper diesel will prove a more logical long term proposition, with its smooth power delivery and admirable real world economy. The X5 Fab does offer company car drivers rock bottom tax bills. But private buyers looking to dodge and London's hefty daily congestion charge will be better off in Volvo's brilliant XC90 T8 twin-engine hybrid. Fitting an SUV with a plug-in petrol-electric drivetrain makes perfect sense. Mitsubishi was the trailblazer, and has seen huge success with the Outlander FEV. Since then, Porsche, Volvo, and Audi have all electrified their SUVs. Now, though, BMW has fitted a powerful 111 bhp electric motor to its 2.0-liter four-cylinder turbocharged petrol engine and dumped it in the X5 SUV. Total output is a healthy 309 bhp. On paper, the X5 X Drive 40E covers the benchmark 0 to 62 miles per hour sprint in exactly the same time as the decidedly less potent 254 bhp X Drive 30D. Official figures suggest the hybrid is almost twice as frugal, though, 83.1 miles per gallon versus 47.1 miles per gallon, while CO2 emissions dip from 158 grams slash km to just 78 grams slash km. What's more, the seemingly impressive CO2 emissions are actually not that remarkable when you compare them with Volvo's 49 grams slash km T8 twin engine hybrid. Like many hybrids, the X5 X Drive 40E offers you a choice of modes to help regulate battery use. Instant to work from the electric motor ensures swift progress off the line, but things feel strained when the engine kicks in, leaving you longing for the grunt from BMW's brilliant six-cylinder diesel. The gearbox isn't always sure which cag to grab, either, and the steering doesn't feel as direct as it is on the smaller but similarly powered 330E saloon. And that is this car's biggest problem. As a standalone SUV, the X Drive 40E is very well mannered, but when you know how good the X5 can be given a punchy yet frugal diesel engine, it leaves you feeling somewhat short changed. Of course, both the Feb and the diesel come well equipped. The £56,705 list price makes the X5 X Drive 40 EM Sport £2,445 more expensive than the equivalent 3.0 liter diesel, broadly matching it spec for spec. However, while you get full leather, 19 inch wheels, and professional nav on both the 40 E and 30 D, if you opt for the hybrid, you'll have to make due with 5 seats rather than 7.